Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Big apology, like first, if this eyelash has come off in the inner corner, I apologize. I've been working so hard to try and get it to stick down and it just is not working with me. So I apologize if that's like annoying, just try not to look there. Even though now I probably have pointed it out, you're just gonna look there anyway. But anyways, let's just get on with this whole video. I don't know why, but I have tried to film this a lot of times and with these like this most simple videos, I get so jittery and I just can't stop moving. So I'm really, really sorry. I'm going to try my best. This is my second time filming this. So yeah, let's hope I get it good. You're going to see this video and be like, how did you have to refilm this? But I mean, I'm a woman of many talents. I just stuff up quite a bit. Longest intro ever. It's about to hit a minute. Let's just get on with the video. So. Guys, this was a bit of a impromptu little shopping trip and that's why I didn't get that many things. But that's also why I just impulse buy a lot of, what, what is it called? I impulse bought a lot of things. I don't know. It was just a lot of impulse buys. So the first thing I'm going to get out of the way, I can feel all the hair, like strands of my hair on me. And it's quite annoying. First things first, I went to JB Hi-Fi, got myself a larger SD card. So at the moment I have a 16 gig SD card and um, I am going to Bali soon, so yay me. Um, what the heck is that? Pew pew. Um, oh my god, is that like offensive? I don't know if guns are offensive at the moment, didn't mean that. So, got this 32 gig SD card because I have a 16 gig one, going to Bali, I already said that. Don't want to repeat myself. Um, <laughs> what was I even gonna say? I am thinking of vlogging it, so if you guys want to see that, let me know. If you don't, and it's like the last thing you want to see from me, tell me. But I'm probably still gonna vlog anyway. And if I don't put it up, then you're lost. I mean, whatever. Um, I just, I just know that I love travel vlogs. Like it's gonna be like a really chill one. It's not gonna be like a professional travel vlog with like heaps of like cool ass shots with like. What are they called? Drones and stuff. I have my little vlog camera <laughs> that I'm going to be bringing. So yeah, I just got an SD card so I could have more room. <laughs> this was $39 by the way. And it's a SanDisk one. I don't know if there's any other brands of them. These are the only ones that I see. Man, SD cards are expensive as heck. Um, but it's an investment. You keep them forever unless they break, you know. So the next little thing that I got was very, very impulsive of me. I had been looking at the Sports Girl palettes for such a long time. And there was this one that had like heaps and heaps of colors, but I think I missed out on getting that. Um, I don't think it, they do it anymore. It was like a huge palette. So I settled for the next best thing and I'll get it right now. I got this Stars in Her Eyes Celestial Eyeshadow Palette. This I think people have been saying is kind of like a knockoff of the one of the Huda Beauty um, palettes. Don't know what it's even called because, to be honest, I don't even look at them because they're so out of my price range. I don't even want to fantasize about them because I know I can't afford them. So, <laughs> this one I got, um, 30 bucks, pretty good price compared to like, I'm guessing like a hundred. I don't know, that's like a random guess. Um, but these are the colors that it comes with. Um, I'm in love with the, I think they're on the bottom row, the purple colors. I think they're gorgeous. Um, here they are, there. Uh, but, you know what? With this moon dust color, right? I'm so excited to use it. But every time I go to use it, like I went to go use it to put it on my eyes today for um, this look. But I end up using Moon Child, which is this one here, which is gorgeous anyway. Um, but I realized this is like kind of like a glitter consistency. So if you put your finger in there to even swatch it. So this is it on my finger. I'm going to try and swatch it on my hand for you. Nothing came off. Like it's still all on my finger. So it didn't really swatch. So it's like a glitter, um, which is fine. So like you have to use like kind of like glitter glue. So it sticks and stuff. I'm guessing. I haven't watched any tutorials or anything explaining how to use it. Um, but yeah, I can see this eyelash is like literally coming off, but yeah, <laughs> we're just gonna have to deal with it. Um, so I'm just in love with the colors in this anyway. Um, these other like shimmery colors are gorgeous. I'll swatch this moon dust one for you. Like 
buttery pigmented yes you have to like build it up a little bit but like not even that much the glitter the one that I put on my eyes today didn't take very long and it's not like frustrating either it's like it's coming out but you just got to put a bit more on than your more expensive eyeshadow palettes and even with the expensive eyeshadow palettes that I have like my expensive ones are like Too Faced and stuff but see this little <sighs> It was just like a strand of hair, but anyway, let's swatch another one because I just love swatching. Um, so there's this other one called Moonshine, which is here, and it's like a gorgeous pink. So I'm just going to swatch that. Ooh. It's like light, but it's gorgeous. And because I have like tan skin at the moment, it doesn't come off like as good, but I love it. Um, yeah, and like, so a matte shade, I'm going to swatch Nova, which is this gorgeous purple shade here. Like, look at that. It's like amazing. I am in love with this and I can't wait to work with more of these colors either. Like, I'm just so wanting to perfect like eyeshadow because I get like... Whenever I get used to a look, I do it all the time. And most of the time, I don't even do eyeshadow unless I am filming. And even then, if you've watched my other videos, I hardly wear eyeshadow really. I think I've stuck to like a really, really basic look. Just because I don't want it to look shit and then have to redo my makeup over and over again. Um, but with this one, I'm just really excited to play with the colours. And yeah, because in all the other eyeshadow palettes, I stuck to like really neutral colors and I really just wanted some like actual color on my face. So yes, buy it, do whatever you like. I don't know. I just love it. So next shop that I went to was actually Glassens and I picked up this cute top that I'm wearing right now. Um, it's a bit see-through like where the white is um, and I'm wearing a black bra. So that's not a good combo. But I just think it's so adorable. It's like a stone beige color and white. And it's like not fitted, but it's not like too baggy, if you know what I mean. It's just a really, really nice fit. That's what I was going to say. And I just really, really love these neutral colors. I'm not a big light color wearer. I'm normally always wearing black or like dark grays and stuff. But I thought this was a cute little top to Spice up my wardrobe with. I don't know why I just started to have a lisp then. Um, but this was $10 in the sale section in my local Glassens. Um, and I just really, really love it. So, next t shirt that I got is very similar to this. Let me just get it. It is this one. Love the colors. They are so funky. They remind me of like 70s, 80s. Um, there was a like long sleeve kind of version of this one, but it was $20 and I got two t-shirts for $20 and I feel like I wear t-shirts a lot more. So, and you can layer t-shirts as well. Oh my God. Ah. Um, yeah, you can layer t-shirts. They're good for summer and winter if you want to layer, etc, etc. Um, and I'm not a big like tank top wearer. I don't really wear singlet tops. So t-shirts are always good for me and the fit of this one is just great. It's like a stretchy kind of material, but it doesn't feel cheap. It feels really good um, and it's soft and I just like felt like heaven when I put this on. <laughs> I have a weird connection with clothes. so And I just love how the sleeves are normal t-shirt sleeves. You know ones that like cut off and like roll up? I hate rolled up t-shirts on me. I think they look really good on other people, but just not me. Um, and I love the round neck, how it's not too low, but it's not too high. Like, I don't know, just a really good combo. I just love everything about this. So really excited to wear these. The last store I went to, I went to La Visa. Um, oh crap. Oh my God, no, my chair's on the back and I just ripped it. Okay, <laughs> see, oopsie. Um, so. Went to La Visa, had the best time in there. I can spend forever in there, like on their little sales turn thing, you know. If you've ever been to La Visa, they have like, why am I really white? Um, if you've ever been to La Visa, they have like the sales, like five for 20 and they like turn. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, I probably seem like a freak, but that's okay. So went to La Visa, 
had the best time. Bought five pairs of earrings for 20 bucks, so they were all four dollars each. And I just think that's great. Even though like not the greatest quality ever, but still for the price that you pay, mine have lasted me such a long time. So I'm just really, really happy with that. Um, I always shop at La Visa, even for necklaces and stuff, always. So the first pair of earrings that I got were actually the ones I'm wearing right now. <laughs> um, so they are these silver cross earrings with like little coins hanging off them. And I just think that detail is so pretty. So I can't stand still when I'm trying to like talk about something. So I have to come back here. But I just think they are so nice. They're not too heavy. They just feel like really nice. You can still move in them. And they just spice up any outfit. So... I'm all for like really showy flashy earrings. I love them. Like what's the point of wearing earrings if they're not gonna be flashy? You know what I mean? So, and like after being in high school for like, well being in school in general, you couldn't wear like funky earrings at my school anyway. Um, so I always had to wear like little sleepers or like the tiniest studs and stuff and it just wasn't fun. So now I ventured out into these funky earrings and I'm just loving them so the next pair that I got were these ones so these are like what are they called they're called star moon mismatch earrings so these are what they look like this is what they look like these I don't know um hold on let me switch them so they're facing the right way okay so this is what they look like so they're like kind of like a peachy gold if you can see, oh my god, the moon is facing the wrong way. That's the moon. With like peach, like little diamantes in it. I think these are so super cute. Um, as I said, I just love flashy earrings. I love celestial themed stuff. Like sun and moon and stars and stuff like that. Even like my little studs are moon and stars and stuff. Like I just am in love. Um, I feel like they just give you good vibes. I don't know. Can jewelry even do that? Um, love these ones. The next ones that I got were actually these. So they are hoops, but they are a bit heavier than your like standard hoop. Um, my other ones aren't out, but I just, ha you've probably seen them in my other videos if you watch them. Um, but they're just like super thin, just your standard hoops. Um, the big the hoop, the big the hoe, you know, those ones in those memes, like that's that style of hoop. Um, so these are a bit thicker. They look like, if you can see like the design on them they just look really textured and they are <laughs> um so yeah i just really love these because they're simple like they're not as flashy as this but they still have a bit of like spunk to them you know and they're a bit groovy i just really really like these the next pair that i got kind of coincide with these ones but they're gold and um they're still different so they have the, th the only thing that's kind of the same is the coins so i'm just really in love with these coin details lately so as you can see like coin here they have like this ugly little pearl here which i'm just choosing to ignore because it was four dollars so not everything can be perfect but they just have this like big just separate little gold nice shiny thing <laughs> like little circle and they have the coins and i just really really love these I can't tell if I'm a gold or silver person because I've been picking up things in both lately and I just love both, so yes. And the last pair that I got were these little crosses. So these are a bit more toned down than the other ones that I got, but um, they still are a bit flashy. So they have like these little diamantes on the cross, if you can see that. Um, and I just think they're super, super groovy and if I want to be a bit more simple with my earrings, I can just chuck these on and they still are, they have a bit of spunk left in them, you know? They're not just too boring or too in your face. They're the right amount, I think. So yeah, that's all I bought from my little shopping trip today. I thought this was literally going to be five minutes long. I don't know how it's going to go when I edit it. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I know it's not on a Love Island one. So many comments are probably going to be like, where's Love Island? Like we wanted Love Island, but guys, really enjoyed uploading them when I first started but now it's like I don't want it to become a chore so I'm just like I want to actually be into it when I upload them and like film them so I, I might feel some tonight because I'm not really doing anything it's a Sunday night kind of chilling um and I have my makeup done and everything so I actually might film them now but like 
please give me a sec. <laughs> like I'm trying really hard. I uploaded so much last week and the week before to do with Love Island and I'm really, really trying. So yes, thank you guys so much for your support anyway. Um, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, don't worry your little cotton socks. Um, yeah, love you lots. See you later. Goodbye. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment, and I'll see you guys in my next video.